fun. I just arrived in Salem, Massachusetts. I have my little Salem road trip shirt on. It's 10.30 in the morning and we literally just arrived. I'm so excited. Oh, there's my mom. Say hi, mom. <laughs> Let's show them our matching shirts. Come sit. Wait. It says, what does it say? Road trip to Salem, Massachusetts. <laughs> and now I'm just gonna put on a little concealer. Cause I look gross. <clears throat> Why are you looking at me like that? Does it look Marching. stupid? No. Oh. My head's four. Forehead is red. I don't wanna look ugly. There's a lot of LGBTQ youth around here. What? I'm watching. It's the show, apparently. Okay. Here's the finished makeup look. Not the best, honestly, but it's the best I can do at the moment. Let's go. And yeah, we literally just got here and haven't done anything, so we need to go. My like, eyebrows turned out a little funky, so we're not gonna talk about that. We're staying at the Peabody House in the Salem Inn. This is not our first time staying in Salem. I've been here, this is my fifth time now. How many times have you been here, Mom? My fourth time. Her fourth time, my fifth time. We're Salem locals now. We're here again. I feel like we never left. This is the house, 15 Summer Street in Salem. Our room is right there. We haven't checked in yet, but we stayed here last time, so we know where it is. Um, yeah. I wanted to vlog last time, but I was shy, but now I've got experience from vlogging in Rome, so, yeah. I'm scared. Actually, people are staring at me, but you know what? I don't care. We're just gonna go walk around and find a bathroom. Ahoy, matey. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi guys. We're outside the Real Pirates um, Museum. It's new. There is a Pirate Museum down the street, but we've been there before, so we're doing this one. We made a new friend. What do you think his name is? Roger. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is Roger, my new friend. I don't think we're allowed to film in here, but Basically, we haven't really done much. We just went in a bunch of shops. I did get tarot cards. I'll show you later, but we're gonna go in here and you might see some clips. You might not. I watch a guy on YouTube and he wasn't allowed to film in here, so I doubt I'm allowed, so. Oh, mom made a new friend. What's his name? I feel like his name is Harold. Harold, like Harry. Love that for you. Yeah. We just left the Pirate Museum, the sign's over there. Oh, okay. Yes, log that, queen. All right, back to me. Ooh, what are your thoughts, Mom? It was okay. It was okay? Would, would you recommend it? If you want to <laughs> find out about pirates, yeah. It's a cool, it's, if you really like pirates, highly recommend. Um, something that I wanted to point out is that they have like a little QR code card where like you take pictures and um, you can download your pictures for free. I thought it was cool that you don't have to pay for it, you know, included with, and you get to be with like a pirate, you know, and we're by the water. <laughs> You're so good at this, mom. <laughs> and like you got to like see actual stuff. It was, I don't even remember the name of it. Shipwreck. We got to touch coins that were touched by pirates. Yeah, real pirates in like 1716 or whatever it was mm -hmm. in the shipwreck. Why do? What? Whatever it is. I, yeah. And you could either do, it's mostly self-guided, but if you want a tour guide, they can give you one. So we did the self-guided one because we're not big museum people. <laughs> right, <Mom? laughs> But that was cool. I think, I think I like the other one better. Yeah, me too. From what I remember. Yeah. So, because there's two pirate museums literally down the street from each other. So they're probably competing for business, but this one's new, so. It's gonna attract more attention, but yeah, that's it. <laughs> the seagulls are there. Go. 
This is the other pirate museum down the street. It's the New England Pirate Museum. I think we like that one a little bit better. Yeah. So this pirate museum's right here, and then literally down the corner, I don't know if you can see, but those balloons, that's the other pirate museum, so. I don't know if they've got beef, but there's two pirate museums within like, not that many feet of each other. I think right now we're going back to a store we were at earlier. We're at a church, and the holy water, because of COVID, is like a dispenser. We're returning to the store. We were here earlier, but my mom really wants to buy something, so. I think that'll look really cute in your room. On secured. The Bag secured from, no. Something Botanicals. Essex Street is popping today. I felt we came in at an off time, but apparently not. Oh my god. towards the hotel. Hi everyone. We made it to the room. I'm gonna give you a quick little room tour. Um, yeah, I took off my eyebrow makeup because it was just too much. Like I can't, I look really bad with it. And I'm also really sweaty and gross right now because it's hot outside. <sighs> We're gonna ignore that. How are you feeling, mom? I'm good. I'm gonna give you a quick room tour and then show you what we bought at the stores. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. Okay, well, I'm gonna come in and show you. This is the front door when you come in, and then literally right to the left is our room, the first room. We got the Peabody Deluxe Room. Comes with a queen bed. Here she is. Harry's joining us. Ta-da. Um, yeah, just like your standard room. It's in this like old house, so it's not like a typical hotel room. Two little chairs filled with our stuff at the moment. She comes with the room. <laughs> we have like stuff everywhere because I'm about to do a haul of everything we got. But here I am looking sweaty and gross. Definitely need some dry shampoo. Little fridge. We got some iced tea, some water. It's literally piss warm right now. Um... Some dark chocolate I bought at CVS. Keurig, you know, the fixins. The toe bathroom. Oh, you already put ourselves in here? A little shower. Me. You know, all the things. Well, we liked it enough to come back another time because we've been here before, so I guess that's quite telling. Wow, I look horrendous. Um, now let's do a mini haul. So first we went to Crowhaven Corner, which is the oldest witch shop in Salem. It's my favorite. I got this necklace there from, uh, this necklace from there last year. And I wear it like every day. It's black tourmaline, protects you from negative energy. My mom got me these Halloween tarot cards. Okay, so these Halloween tarot cards were Sounds like someone's breaking in. My mom is leaving. Um, these Halloween tarot cards were $18.95. Oh, we could do a little unboxing. That might be fun. How cute. Little tin. Halloween tarot. Happy Halloween. Oh, okay. How cute. I'm not going to open it right now. <laughs> but... You get the, the gist, it's like that. Um, we went to Coven's Cottage. 
It's a little amethyst bracelet and it was $5 with a little moon on it. Five bucks, you can't beat it. Total at Kevin's Cottage was $18.02. We got nine crystals, one bracelet, and this little bag to put our crystals in, which I picked out myself. Cute little pouch. So I'm gonna read the nine that we got. And if you wanna know what they're for, you can look them up just cause it's gonna take too long for me to tell you. If you wanna pause and read. Um, I don't wanna read them out loud in case I mispronounce them and get shit on by the crystal community. So I took this little sheet with all the meanings on it. Um, where else did we go? Oh, we went to a little like botanical apothecary shop. Mom, you wanna tell them why you were drawn to this thing? Got this little book looking thing. It's like a hidden thing to put stuff in. I thought it was very pretty. That's it? And it reminded me of you. Aww. Even though my long hair is no longer long, well, it's growing. It as as uh, so yeah, got that. Thank you, Mom. This is a random purchase that we saw at the, what was it, a gas station? Yes. I just saw these and I wanted to try them because I've never seen them before. Doritos flavored popcorn. So we're gonna do a taste test later. Right now we're still very full from lunch. Do a little CVS haul. There's a CVS right on Essex Street, which is the strip, basically the main street in Salem, where like all the touristy stuff is. And there's a CVS, so we need some stuff. We got dental floss picks because, fun fact, I have my wisdom teeth growing in and there's a gap in between my tooth and my gum and food gets caught in it. And I don't want it to get infected, so I have to keep picking it out. Gross. Um, mouthwash, a toothbrush for me and my mom because we forgot toothbrushes, toothbrush caps. Batteries for my Polaroid camera and this little fun rainbow beauty blender. Wow, because if you didn't know, I'm gay. Whatever you say. Okay, yeah, so I needed that, cause rainbow. That's it, that's my haul. See you in a second. Okay guys, we're here at the Witch Sweet Mall and our favorite store, Witch Tees, where we got these t-shirts and everyone asks us about them. This is where we got them, Witch Tees. It says, Hocus Pocus, I'll cast a spell on you in Salem, Massachusetts. A medium. Every year we come here, there's like more and more Hocus Pocus merch. Like the f very yeah. first time we came here, there was like none. But we're looking for that zipper up sweatshirt. Hi guys. We're looking, f we're on the hunt for a zipper up white sweatshirt from my mother. Look at this one, she crashed into the glass. <laughs> Queen, what do you think? I mean, it's it. gray, does gray go with everything? Yeah, what do you mean? It's like a basic color. Like if I'm wearing purple, if I'm wearing pink, any color? Yes, it's gray, Mom. Right, that looks cute on you, Mom. This is cute pride shirt and I wanna get it but I'm gonna hold off because I'm here tomorrow too and the day after, so if this keeps calling my name, we'll come back. Push my knocker? What does that mean? There is none. We're glowing. Hey guys, we're in the Halloween Museum. They gave us 3D glasses. I think this is only for certain parts though. Okay. <laughs> we will take it. What? I would say that word says famous. <laughs> okay, subscribe, I guess.
How's yours? It's good. Where are you filming? <laughs> and Diet Pepsi. Cheers. <laughs> Piece of cheese. <laughs> Actually, very good. Highly recommend. You can't stop us. Our eyes can see men with inside. Men and grand. Hi friends, we're outside the town hall. We just got drinks at the Lobster Shanty. We sat at the bar, my first time in Salem at the bar. Um, yeah, I got a blue Jane and I'm really feeling it. It had like rum and vodka and stuff. Super fun. Um, that was like my first experience sitting in a bar. This is like awkward. Um, we, I met this woman named Mary Ellen. Shout out to you. She was like 51. She was saying she loves Harry Styles. And I, of course I had to include myself in the combo. And I was like, I have a Harry Styles tattoo. We were just talking. So yeah. Apparently I'm not antisocial anymore. <laughs> now we're deciding if we want ice cream or not. Because we don't know if that'll mix with drinks. But it's really hitting me now. So yeah, that's the plan for tonight. I'm coming. Ooh, it's cool in here. We got our ice cream. I always get the same one every time I'm here. The Snickers. This is a small Snickers ice cream. What'd you get, Mom? Pistachio. Mm. Good. Was it a nice view? Hi, friends. We are back from ice cream and drinks. How was your day, Mom? It was good. It was good. We had a really fun day. Super tired since we got up very early. I am running on three hours of sleep. It's 8.30, we got up at what, five o'clock? I got up at four. Okay, well, I did not. Um, that'll be it for today's video. Make sure to stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog. Tomorrow we're doing a lot. We have a lot planned. Um, including going on the trolley tour, I'm doing a tarot reading, we're gonna go on a night tour, and lots more shopping, and probably more stuff that we don't even know. Subscribe to Heather. Yes, subscribe, make sure you are liking this video, subscribing, following me on all my socials, and stay tuned for the next video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!